Hello, good morning, students. Welcome to the second class of estimation and costing. Uh, today, we'll discuss on calculating the quantities with respect to the individual structural elements. So, before we start with uh, the quantity calculation, let us understand a few concepts related to the bar bending schedule. What we are going to study today. So, for bar bending schedule, it is mainly uh, dealt with finding out the steel quantity required for individual RCC elements such as slab, beam, columns and footings. So to calculate what is the amount of steel required in terms of kg or quintal or tons, we should know what is the unit weight of the standard bar diameters that are used in the construction. So to know what are the unit weights, so firstly uh, we should know what are the bar diameters so bar diameters as you can see which are used on construction sites and available in the market readily are starting from 6 mm 8 mm 10 mm 12 mm 16 mm 20 mm and 25 mm so these are the readily available bar diameters in special cases we go for using of 18 mm diameter bars and 22 mm diameter bars so I have restricted the bar diameters up till 25 mm. We have bar diameters beyond 25 mm, but for now we'll restrict it up to 25 mm. So to calculate the unit weight, you should know what is the area of the bars. So area of the bar is calculated using a formula pi by 4 into d square. It will give you the area of the bars. So this area of the bar is calculated. I know what is density of steel, I know what is area of steel. So to calculate what is the weight of the bar for 1 meter length. If you take a bar of length 1 meter, you should know what is the weight of that particular bar for different diameters. So that is what we call it as unit weight of the bar or per meter weight of the bar. So to calculate per meter weight of the bar, we use a relation area into density. We have already calculated what is area. We know what is density of steel. It is 78850 78, kg per meter cube. So area is in meter square and this is in meter cube. So we'll get kg per meter. So 0 0.22 kg per meter indicates the unit weight of 6 mm diameter bar. If you take a bar of 6 mm diameter and cut it for 1 meter length the weight of that particular bar will be 0 0.22 kg for 1 meter length so this is one way of calculating or we have one more shortcut approach of calculating the unit weight that is using a relation d square by 162 d square by 162 so here d square should be substituted in terms of mm and divided by 162 so to calculate unit weight of 6 mm diameter bar as well as 6 square by 162 you will get 0.22 kg per meter similarly you have to remember all this unit weights up to 25 mm or remember this formula so 0 0.22 0 0.395 0 0.61 0 0.89 1.58 mm. 2.46 3.86 hope you are clear with this thank you